Ladies and gentlemen, our next competitor, Ilya Malignan. So here is the man of the moment. The defending champ, he's 19 years of age from Virginia, Ilya Malignan. Changing the sport, taking it to new heights. The quad axle, not in this short, not planned, but he is a guy on the march, on the road to Milan in the Olympics. Ilya already the most iconic face in men's figure skating. Because of his technical prowess, quad toe to open. Absolutely beautiful. Nearly four points in grade of execution. And his most difficult jumping pass Quad Lutz triple toe, other than the quad axle, the quad Lutz is the most difficult quad there is. Oh, great height on that quad, right into a triple toe. Difficult, you say? He makes it look easy. Two elements and look at that technical score box. There are seven in the short program. <laughs> Final jump here to the lax on the music. Raspberry twist. Woo! At some point, he wasn't yeah. even competing. Well, he was just showing off. <laughs> and, and that's exactly what Ilya loves to do, to show off. And boy, were those quads just heavenly. And artistically, Johnny, we've talked so much about how he's trying to grow as an artist to make sure that his component score is comparable to his technical score. And I see so much improvement since last year to this year. And really, I see a lot of improvement from the beginning of the season, much like Nathan Chen over the years as he was growing up, becoming an Olympic champion. He tried different styles of music, and it's, it's working for Ilya in the same way. It was okay. <laughs> he said, how, how are you? You have fun? Yeah. It was fun to yell at them everywhere. <laughs> that, to help you to get the Shane Lee's advice to help you with energy. Oh, yeah, for Shane and Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. He's saying it's okay. It's okay. No, he just crushed yeah. that thing. Not only is the technical score over 60 points, you think 100 points is the benchmark for the world. 61.99 is his technical score. All of his component scores are in the nines. 10 is the highest you can get. Incredible presence out there. This is the quad. Let's look at that wind up. 
into this quad. Let's tight air position, feet and elbows. Quad, let's triple toe. A little wobbly there on the landing, but just stunning. And then his his dad, divide, divide, isn't that go, go, go? Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Yep, last jump of the program. Woo! All right. good job. All right. Here's that raspberry twist called raspberry because Manina is raspberry in Russian. It's really an aerial in breakdancing world, but for ice, we'll call it the raspberry twist. Look at the crowd behind him, too. Hanging on every move. Well, we Here queen we out every time he takes the ice, Terrence. Uh, yeah. So good. You can't help yourself. You know what? He's just going to keep breaking that scoring computer. Oh, my goodness, guys. Remember when we said the 100 mark was the benchmark for the best in the world? Well, he just beat it again. His dad right there in the kiss and cry. We told you his mom not here. Doesn't even watch on TV because she's too nervous. So nervous. She just waits for dad to call her and say, yeah, I did great. <laughs> Quad God indeed. Well, you guys are all in awe, but uh, Ilya, you're sitting here and you're like, nah, you know, <laughs> what were your thoughts? It was hard to read the expression on your face at the end of the program. I mean, I was just kind of grateful that I got through everything, especially with the past few weeks having a lot of skate malfunctions. And, you know, I was just a little bit nervous going to this event. And I'm lucky I was able to stay on my feet and just really perform for the audience. I definitely felt the energy, especially towards the end of the program, just they're all connecting towards me. And I was, you know, I had the energy to fight through. So you're changing the sport. We've talked about that a lot. And people are calling this the Ilya era. In your mind, what does that look like? What do you want it to be? I definitely wanted to be somewhere where I'm able to try to be a unique skater and to always try to develop new interesting tricks or new ways of skating or just new unique choreography I think is one of my main goals for this. No quad axle in the short program, huge lead going into the free. You don't need it, but what about the free skate? Will we see it there? I think I'll have to think about it, especially with how this whole week has been, and I'll see before the free. We'll see what happens. Well, if the fans get a vote, you know what it is. <laughs> of course, yeah. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you.